I'm going to show you how to set up your iPad or iPhone for remote monitoring in DaVinci Resolve Studio. Now I'm going to be honest here and say that I'm not going to be forking out thousands and thousands of dollars for an Apple display. My Dell monitor is doing just fine, but I still want to know how my footage will look on Apple devices because let's face it, most content is viewed on these Apple devices. So it pays to get a real time view of what that will look like straight from your editing software. Head to the App Store on your phone or tablet and search for DaVinci Remote Monitor and hit download. While that is downloading, go and create a Blackmagic Cloud account. I'll post a link in the description to the Blackmagic Cloud site. All right, now jump back into your editing project and head to the Workspaces tab up the top. Scroll down to Remote Monitoring, select that, and you'll see this pop up in the corner here. This is our remote monitor session. Uh, here are the settings we can choose. I usually like to select H.265 and 10 bit, and I'll usually just bump my bit rate up to about 20. That way you get a high quality image on your iPad or iPhone for color grading. And we're just gonna hit start session. Now what that's done is it's generated this key code. And so if you have universal clipboard set up, all you're gonna to need to do is copy over here and then come to your iPad and hit the paste button and hit join. And there we go, our remote monitor session is all set up. So basically whatever output is coming from Resolve is, get that right, is coming onto my iPad here or if you wanna use your iPhone. I find this especially useful when you just wanna see how your edit or your color is looking on Apple devices. To end the session, all we need to do is just come down and click end session here, and then that will close it down on the iPad as well. I hope you found this tip useful. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments and I'll see you in the next one.